could not be similar classmates. Based on Ignacio Crawford's other journal, I agree with his opinion. One of the areas that some writers must work with it are students. Students are the major agent that use water in different activities, such as personal cleanliness, washing clothes, and cleaning their rooms, living room, and bathroom meticulously each Wednesday. Adding to Ignacio's opinion, so Morano, in order to conserve water, should reward those dorms who use the smallest amount of water each month. In my point of view, this action will encourage students to conserve water. On the other hand, Ignacio mentioned that the water would not disappear, but it will be unevenly distributed. I support this idea. The people who are suffering a lack of potable water in potable water are people from the third world countries because in the majority of cases their governments do not have a conservation water plan and the country countries like the United States and others have the conscious that part of the water is running out so they develop different activities in order to take care of this precious gift in conclusion it is important that Sufurano introduce different methods and activities in the water conservation plan. Changing the toilets to more efficient ones, reward the water dorms that reduce its water consumption, or recycling water will help to achieve this goal. To take care of the model water used each day in the campus, without making any damage or contamination to a natural resource. Thanks for watching my video and blessings.